guys good afternoon it's your girl miss des good afternoon good afternoon good afternoon how's everybody doing today your girl is getting ready to make a pasta a pasta cheesy dish it's going to have in it penne noodles it's going to have some board and taco cheese in it and we're going to have some queso de papa we're going to have some uncured pachetta that came from trader joe's from a trader joe's hall and we're going to have the light cream cheese from Trader Joe's. And we're going to have some Parmesan cheese, minced garlic. I have my cherry tomatoes in here cooking on top of the pan, in the frying pan, with a little olive oil and some garlic. And I have my water boiling back there for my noodles. Let's get the... Oh, and I have some tomato paste, too, from Trader Joe's. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so I put a little salt in my water. They were boiling, but when I dropped the noodles in, you know how that goes. I have my cherry tomatoes and garlic right here in the olive oil. Now I'm getting ready to add my uncured pachetta. We're going to get this party rolling. Rolling. We keep it moving. Miss Deb's on the stove. She got it grooving. What's your plan? Because I saw I said taco cheese. No, that's not what I wanted to do. So this whole meal has been rerouted. Mm -hmm. So I have the queso de papa cheese. Then I have sharp cheddar cheese which is the same thing but this is some shredded this is some boarding i have light cream cheese parmesan i put the garlic in here with the pochetta and i also added pepperoni and my noodles are almost done we have some oregano over here follow the ingredients folks because sometimes i don't put these ingredients in my description i know i do say it a lot but you know, after doing so many videos, I think I got up like 500 and something videos and I've just been doing YouTube. I started in 2010, but it was just a dead channel for nine years. And then 2019, I put up my first video. And then um, I didn't come back to like, really like, two, the end of 2019, I did a couple. Then 2020, I went ham in 21. So... This is um why I have so many videos up because COVID had hit and I was doing a lot of things, you know, because I was stuck in the house. So I don't put up the recipes all the time to make a long story short. I know I said, forgive me for being a storyteller. I don't mean to do that, folks. Trust me and believe me. But I will put them up sometime. But if you can just follow through with me sometime, I'll tell you everything that goes in. Measurement wise, you do. What you want to do, because everybody measurements are not going to be the same. You might like a little more cheese than I do. I might like a little more gar garlic than you do. So just, you know, just go along with it with me, please. Okay, so we have pancetta and pepperoni in here. That's Hormel pepperoni. We have our noodles over here. I'm getting ready to uh, drain. Cheese is shredded. We have the other cheese there. We have Parmesan. We have light cream cheese. We have... Italian tomato paste. We have minced garlic. We have oregano. I'm getting ready to put this together. Let me turn this off. Drain that grease, you know, from the pepperoni and the pochetta. We're going to drain that because I put a little olive oil in it to get it going, but it made so much oil. So we're going to drain that. Okay, guys, I'll be back. Hey, okay, guys, so the ingredients I have in here is the pan, pan seared, uh, pan sauteed uh, cherry tomatoes, the minced garlic, then I just added some um, Italian tomato paste and I have my cream cheese here because I forgot to take it out earlier. So we're going to mix this together. Then I'm going to add a little salt and pepper to taste only a little because you know I don't like salt. We're going to add oregano, then put the cheese and we're going to put it in a casserole dish in a 350 degree oven for 35 minutes. I'll show you the results after I mix all this together. Guys, right, so if I don't put the recipe in the descriptions, I'm going to tell you. I boiled the noodles, the penne uh, regat noodles, right? Then I um, added the sautéed cherry tomatoes and the minced garlic. And then I drained the uh, oil from the pepperoni and the pachetta that I also put in the pan with the cherry tomatoes and the garlic. I drained my noodles, put them in a bowl, added the pancetta pepperoni and sun-dry, I mean, and the tomatoes and the garlic, mix that in the bowl. Then I added some black pepper, a teaspoon of sugar, some oregano, a cup of um, cheddar cheese, um, a half a cup of milk, 
and I added uh, around about two tablespoons of um, Italian tomato paste and I added a half a cup of Parmesan cheese. So now I'm going to mix all that together. Then I'm going to put it in a pan and put cheese on top with a little um, some uh, cheddar cheese and a little Parmesan cheese and some oregano on top. Okay. All right, guys. Okay, guys, that's how I look when it's mixed together. Now I'm going to put it in the pan. I'm going to spray my pan with some um, olive oil spray. Hey, guys, Miss Leilani came home from school today, had her lunch with her Mima, and now she's going to help me do the rest of this recording. Right, Lay? You want to say anything to them? Oh, well, hey, Tell them guys. thank you for the prayers for your mom. Thank you for the prayers for my mom. She, she's back safely, but keep praying for her. She needs to be okay. And please, let's all pray. Father God, we ask you to bless her. Okay, guys, so that is it. We're going to put it in a 350-degree oven for 35 yeah, minutes. We have the cheddar cheese on top, the Parmesan cheese, and we put some oregano on top with a little black pepper. And we're going to stick this mm -hmm. bad boy in the oven, mm -hmm. and we're going to see mm -hmm. what it's working with. Right, Lay? Mm -hmm. And we're going to keep that part in where the phone <laughs> fell because you know what? I was going to delete it, but life happens and everybody can't be perfect. And when we do our videos, we have to do editing and stuff. But you know what? It's okay to leave it in. Sometimes that's life. Things happen. Everything is not perfect. Yep, so I'm going to like... leave it in there. We dropped the phone, right? Mm. <laughs> not clumsy, so. No, that's okay, sweetheart. All right. Thank you for helping me record. Hey, guys. This is the pizza pasta. It has the penne pasta. It has um, Parmesan cheese, cheddar cheese. It has black pepper. Um, I'm back. It smells just like a pizza. Sauteed. It does smell like a pizza, doesn't it? <sighs> sauteed. <Majul>. Um, <laughs> sauteed tomatoes with garlic. And it has pepperoni and bruschetta. Oh, it smells so Majul. good. <laughs> Lay like crazy. And Look it has... Guys, um, <laughs> and it has um oregano on top. Mm, oh my can god, I, this can is Can I just a, get a noodle? You can't eat it because they have pork. I'm so can sorry. I just get a noodle. Oh god. Okay, guys, this is it. Thank you for joining your girl. Thank you for Miss Leilani helping me with the camera, right, Lay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's I a sweetheart. I don't want any. Okay, you don't want any. That's I know, I know, baby. All right, guys, thank you for joining me. And this is the pizza pasta with pepperoni and pochetta. Okay, guys, <laughs> look at me. Oh, Keep it's PPPP. -P -P -P. Pizza pasta with pepperoni and pochetta. Four Call P's. PPPP, -P -P -P, guys. <laughs> okay, guys, bye. Have a nice day. God bless you. Thank you for joining your girl, Miss Deb.